Justin Bieber's hair is just as iconic as his music. However, did he struggle with hair loss and has he recently had a hair transplant surgery? Hair loss is very common and it can affect anyone, even somebody like Justin Bieber. I will be going through the years of Justin Bieber's hair and analyzing it so we can get to the truth behind Justin Bieber's hair loss. start with his hair in 2008. 2008, 14 years old. Fortunately, he's not showing any signs of hair loss at this time. He's got a very youthful appearance. His hair is, I can't see his entire forehead, but his hair is hanging down onto his forehead. Great coverage, great hair. 2013, Justin's 19 years old. He's wearing his hair a little differently than he did a few years before that. He's wearing it up. And this is exposing his forehead, but it's still in a very youthful location. Looks great. I don't see any signs of hair loss at this time and he's 19. Not infrequently, some men with uh, heavy predisposition in the family history of hair loss, they'll start to show signs of a recession. Not Justin. 2015, he's 21 years old now, and he's starting to show a little bit of um, degradation of his frontal hairline. It's, it's in some areas, it looks to be receding slightly, it's getting a little bit thinner. He started to develop a more mature male hairline. That's not totally unexpected at 21 years old. 2017, he's about 23 years old now. It looks very similar to what it was a couple years prior at 21. He's wearing his hair a little bit differently. I'm not sure if that's a result of any fear he has about losing his hair, but still looks very youthful appearance, very appropriate for a 23 year old. 2018, Justin's 24 years old now, wearing his hair a little bit longer, pulling it back, and what that's doing is exposing a mature male hairline now. He's starting to show signs of some recession, some temple recessions, a little bit of thinning, scalloping in the frontal hairline. If I had to take a guess at 24, it looks like he's at risk for some male pattern loss. Now would be a great time for him to get on some medical therapies. In 2020, Justin was 26 years old and he started to wear his hair like he did when he was uh, 14 years old. Hair down to his forehead, wearing it much longer. If I had to guess, I think he's getting concerned about the recessions and he's trying to cover that up. 2021, Justin's 27 years old. He's wearing a bandana now. Uh, that's a sure way to cover a forehead recession. He's wearing his hair uh, in dreadlocks. Uh, what people should know is that dreadlocks actually um, puts people at risk for something called traction alopecia. The process of creating the dreadlocks and the weight of the dreadlocks themselves can actually pull on the hair follicles themselves causing some loss. So with the previous photos of, of uh, having a hint of hair loss, if he's worried about hair loss, he ought to be on medications. Looking at some photos from 2022, Justin's about 28 years old now. He's wearing a variety of different hairstyles, um, specifically some shorter ones. Sometimes shorter hairstyles can actually disguise some hair loss. It tends to make the hair look a little bit more full. Uh, if you comb it forward, obviously it's going to cover recession to some degree. I think he has male pattern loss, definitely showing signs of it, and whether or not he's going to do something about it, we'll see here in the next few photos. A photo from 2023, and Justin's about 29 years old. Um, looks like he's out having a good time, but one thing I notice is his hairline looks flatter, especially on the right side. Um, a few years prior to that, in 2018, he had a definite recession, a very scalloped frontal hairline, and now it's flatter onto his forehead. Uh, much more linear. There's no medication that's that's going to turn a scalloped uh, receding hairline around. So I think based on the, the photo from 2023, I would say he's likely had a hair restoration surgery. So we saw some, some photos from Justin Bieber from when he was a teenager to when he's uh, in his early adulthood. He definitely shows signs of losing his hair and I hope someone counseled him or he sought some help. Medical therapies are really important for someone uh, in their 20s to prevent massive loss of hair. So if you look at his photos, I think he, he definitely had a hair transplant. The shape of his hairline changed. Usually the shape of a hairline doesn't change with medical therapies. The likelihood is he's using a combination, medical therapies, surgical therapies to give him the hairline that he's really comfortable with. I think if anybody is, is interested in doing the same thing for themselves, seek out a professional, come talk to us at Restore. We've had a lot of experience with not only A-listers, but the general public. We'd be happy to help you, help you guide through your issues with hair loss. I mentioned earlier that something can be done about your hair loss. You should watch this video to learn about the top five solutions that really work for your hair loss.